what classes he was taking, all that stuff. He was a freshman. Um, <clears throat> and I was like, well, do you, sounds kind of like you're pretty bugged about the, the uh, exhibit being up. Is there, have you kind of had some, uh, some friends that had some experience with it or anything like that? And he's like, well, actually my girlfriend and I had one done um, my freshman year of high school and to this day it's the biggest thing I've ever regretted and to this day it eats me up inside every day and he's like I just get choked up with it this stuff because he knows that he's like I know that that was my baby um, so immediately the conversation turned from is it right or wrong to um, the grace that God gives because he started asking me and he's like well are you a Christian and I was like yeah you better believe it and he was like, <laughs> he's like, he's like, do you think this is an unforgivable sin? And I was like, oh my gosh, like no. And so we started walking through some scripture about like how God's grace basically covers all sin and all fall short of the glory of God. And then only through Christ are we saved. And, uh, um, and so at that point, um, like I was really curious to see what she thought about it as well. I um, mean, she said that these images, she had seen pictures like them before, um, when she found out she was pregnant, she went online and like um, Googled abortion um, just to like become informed. Um, and she found pictures very similar to the ones on the display. Um, and because of that, that was part of the reason that she chose to keep her child. Um, and so she's um, decided to um, go ahead and um, she's gonna keep her child. Um, my third conversation was with a girl named Catherine. And um, it was so interesting because it like followed the script in the manual like so well and it was it was so funny because i was like talking to her i was like oh my gosh i had this conversation <laughs> yesterday and so um she was just saying she was just like she was like you know it's just a bunch of cells and it's not a person yet and i was like i know what to say to you <laughs> um, because not only did you guys come up to me and ask me how i was doing but you guys you guys hearts have been broken by jesus you guys aren't hardened and you went out there and you did something about it and that really just touched me because I go to that school I deal with those people every day I feel like I'm alone I felt like the girl who thought her opinions didn't matter but you guys went out to my school and you just spoke up for what you believed in and it was incredible I I don't have any like really amazing stories but just see you guys out there fighting for what's right and just following through on God's command to do what he asks. Not worried about what happens, but just doing it anyways. You guys are awesome, and I'm really glad that I get to go to school with you. So thanks.